Welcome to the Outer Worlds. All right, there's now a PS5 edition of this. I've actually uh, played the uh, original version. It's been a while. I think I might have just barely made it off the first planet. So, if you know anything about the game, that's not too far in. And if you don't know anything about the game, that's not too far in. Anyway. I love how they let you zip through this, even though maybe not, not going to read it, but you can't get through that without zipping through it. Left logo. I see a center logo. There's a left logo, okay. It's going to put 50% just because. Yes, in other words, I will not be doing that in time in the near future, but we'll be doing them eventually. So I'm guessing Charters is the last of the uh, last thing. Story mode, of course. That's what we're the game. Of course, I wanted to cut scene in movies. I like subtitles. Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier, owned and operated by corporations. A trip of 10 short years will feel like mere minutes, thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. Right. Okay, so I want to be able to. Sneak a lockpick, that's important. Hack and persuade, that's important. Science is important. There's also increased lockpicks, so let's do that. Hacking, persuading. Uh, 
Alright, so this is for so every 20 that gives me 10%. Pain abilities, positive faction reputation. Negative faction reputation. Extra headshot damage. Vocal damage. Open attack speed. Then increase my strength. Oh, so here, lock pick. I swap sneaky. Oh, fine. And that's my health rate. Let's go ahead and get that up to two. Alright. Skills. Two points available. I really don't care about melee. be able to dialogue and stealth. So let's put a point in dialogue. You could make a vicar doubt the law. If you wanted to steal from the rich, you've come to the right colony. Working your way up to provisioner? I'm a cashier. We don't have loyalty points. Be twenty or more to get a bonus. Coward and fear for four seconds after you hit them. <laughs> Seriously. Fifteen percent chance auto mechanicals will work like other enemies. Like I know where I'm going to crouch, but yeah, that's, that was the plan. I like the ability to sell goods of vending machines. If they are acquire one mag pick, they're free. I like that. Okay, well, I do have 21 in it, but it's not. Oh, because the suit, not because of the skill. So I don't get the uh, benefit of the uh, 20 because of the spell of armor, not my skill. That's been mine, but whatever. Anyway. Okay. Let's do this.
Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. Not likely, bootlickers. <laughs> Initiate skip jump. you are wondering what's going on, eh? A bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on the Hope have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, <laughs> reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Oh, yes, well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see, yes? Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck! Big things happen. Can you hear me? Is this thing working? Ah, there you are. Now, uh, where were we? Oh, yes, the smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. He's to be your uh, chauffeur, so to speak. And not to worry, I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one-of-a-kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor, so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm... All the colonists are counting on you. I think we're sideways. Ah, you've landed good. Hawthorne should be close by. What in law's name? Is that him? Oh, that idiot. I told him to <laughs> plant the beacon and move away, not stand there holding it. Yeah. Oh well, no sense in letting his ship go to waste. Hawthorne won't mind you taking his ship. Better you than the board, huh? Not sure I trusted the fellow. Might have gone after the bounty on my head. Shame about the whole squashing thing. Nasty way to go. Yeah.
circle. I don't know what. So in the middle of the circle, they look like there was, there was all the other things. Like I'm not sure whatever that is. I don't feel like fighting them. I've got a uh, sweet bonus anyway. You've tried the best now. <laughs> now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stinks. Uh, looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't mind me omitting this little exchange for my report. Spacer's choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. Better, thanks to you. I might have bled out on my own. Or worse, had to go begging the boss for some Madrina time. We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take him. Then my gun misfired. Right through my side. I mean, what are the odds of that, right? Just barely scraped by with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Gibbering, flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed lunatics with guns. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them all out with a single shot. Not bad, huh? Yeah, okay. You look like you know your way around a gun. Got some spare ammo. Not counting the bullet in my side. Here, you can have my saber too, for patching me up and all. All Spacer's Choice weapons are now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's Choice. Yes, nailed it that time. You hit your head or something? You're in Emerald Vale. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Edgewater's a little ways down. Uh, prettiest place in the Vale. Uh, be sure to stop by a provisioner's for a can of our famous salt tuna. The Hope? 
Is that some sort of fancy new drug? Are you with Auntie Cleo or something? Don't take this the wrong way or nothing, but I'm not allowed to fraternize with Cleo workers. Company policy. Well, that's a good start. Not anyone near the town yet, but yeah. Thanks for watching. 
Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like, subscribe, and click the notification bell below. On the upper left, you will find the playlist for this game. Below that, you will find a link to a video that YouTube thinks that you would enjoy the most of all the videos on my channel. I have many games of many different types. I hope you would enjoy those videos as well. Thanks again. Goodbye.